Welcome back, uh, dear viewers, and you are still uh, watching The Breakfast Show. And uh, in this uh, segment of our program, we will talk about uh, the new uh, government as uh, the uh, new government will take the oath at the presidential headquarters in Heliopolis on Wednesday. The senior government source said the cabinet reshuffle includes 20 portfolios, adding that a comprehensive ministerial overhaul is taking place and to shed more light on the new cabinet we are joined over the phone by Mr. Amr Abdurrahman he is a journalist good, after good morning sir well good morning to you hello to you and the dear viewers yes uh, Mr. Amr how do you see uh, the most important files that are at the forefront of the uh, new government's concerns uh, there is there is more than a uh, critical file to be uh, looked over uh, by the new government uh, or the same government with the new shuffle. Uh, there is uh, files to be corrected. Yes. There, is, uh, there are files to be uh, continued mm. and other files to be uh, implemented and tackled on. I believe that there is a, a change uh, in some uh, of the strategies concerning uh, choosing the uh, uh, some of the ministers and others are expanding in uh, in some concepts in in the choice. I believe that uh, in, in the uh, in the concern of uh, uh, gathering the transportation and industry uh, uh, minister. A ministry of uh, as as one a minister and or under the the, uh, the supremacy of uh, 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 the leadership of one minister is a very important uh, um, step. There is, uh, I believe, that always there is a, 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 a it's a good thing to to have a, a military a military leader in in, in the most of the uh, the ministers, and this is a very important and positive step. Also, uh, the gathering of uh, some of the, the, uh, the ministers together uh, to conserve uh, efforts and conserve uh, um, the powers and con to concentrate the, the, the efforts towards the, the, the main aspect, towards the main aspect and a, and a true vision for this, uh, for this uh, two uh, ministers to get all together to put all their efforts uh, redirected in one uh, better direction or, or one stronger direction. There are, of course, others, especially in the, in the field of uh, econ economy, that, mean, that needs to be uh, corrected and uh, to, be to be enhanced around some very critical points. We are in a matter of war, uh, not just uh, by army, but by economy. Uh, there, is, uh, there are lots of challenges that we are facing right now, yes. and it takes uh, lots of efforts and lots of concentration and, and a new administration uh, in the, in the, uh, under the umbrella of the, uh, the Minister of Economy and Finance to be uh, to face uh, such challenges that we have never uh, faced before we have our own diplomacy our own strategy our own uh, vision to have a balanced balanced uh, economy uh, between between two wings one of the wings are the governmental sector and the, the military uh, um, economical and industrial and agricultural sector on the other wing, here comes the private sector, which uh, should take the, the step and take the chance that, we, that uh, the, 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 uh, the government has opened the door all wide up for its participation. Um, and I believe that uh, this is a chance for the private sector to, 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 to have the, 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 that positive and important uh, vision. Uh, from the, the government towards concerning and uh, c concentrating on the, uh, the, the mega projects which uh, served, truly served the, the, future, the future of this country, the, the future of this nation that serves the, 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 the citizen 
the ordinary citizens all, uh, all over the republic, the new republic that we are seeking to achieve. And of course, there is um, a, a dramatic change in the, uh, in the, in the ministry, ministry of uh, Foreign Affairs. Yes. And I believe that Mr. Badr Abdelati uh, can take, uh, take, take it from where uh, Mr. Samak Shukri has ended. Because uh, it's, it, we need, of course, a new blood in the ministry, and we, and we need... Uh, to keep that strategy, that planned, that intelligent, but, but concerning our relations with the East and the West at the same spot, and to, to remember that we are facing uh, and taking the lead. Egypt has taken the lead in this world uh, right afterwards. To confront the, color, uh, the, the Western influence and the uh, colonization uh, greed of the West uh, against the first, uh, and we have changed the vision of the world that we should stand together. Egypt has given uh, the first birth for, or of the idea of BRICS. When we have stood together, uh, Egypt and uh, Russia and other countries, to stand against uh, the Western uh, influencing Greeds, as well as to, uh, to have the same, to have this um, balanced strategies uh, towards the East and keeping strong relations and strategic, uh, strategic, uh, strategic relations with the West also. We are, we have a really having a strategic uh, official relations with Russia and, and China. And on the other hand, we have the same uh, with the U.S. and other countries and uh, the European uh, Union uh, that uh, Mr. Bel Abdelati was an, our ambassador, uh, the uh, um, Europe, uh, EU. And of course, we need to tackle on some very important issue here, which is the, uh, the occupied. So, uh, Mr. Amr, uh, what are the achievements of uh, the outgoing uh, gov uh, cabinet? And uh, as you all know that uh, they started many initiatives like Decent Life, uh, we are all one initiative, 100 million health, the importance and significance of continuing such initiatives uh, with the new government. The most uh, huge, uh, one of the most huge and important and historical uh, mega projects that the leadership, the political and the military leadership has uh, created uh, and uh, followed up by the, the, the past government uh, uh, or the, 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 um, uh, the government before uh, being shuffled or, or, ch or changing some of the, the faces. We need to tackle on the same, we need from the government to tackle and expand those uh, mega projects that concerning the, the, the daily life and the true needs of the, uh, the, uh, the on, on a huge sector of the uh, as we are uh, still in the in the in the in the phase of reform reforming our own uh, economy and of course we need to protect the the, the greater sector of the, the from the the outcomes uh, of those re reforms. So, so I believe that there is a, a great responsibility uh, for this uh, new uh, cabinet to take and to hold on tight to prevent any uh, negative uh, outcomes uh, uh, that comes or, uh, for, as a result of the, the chemical re uh, reforms. We need uh, to remember that there are two sides, uh, two faces of the, uh, of the work which is going on and building our own e uh, economy on a new basis that g gathering the private sector and the governmental sector as well as we keep the, the citizens safe from uh, some of the, 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 um, the, the negative points like, uh, like, mo like monopoly, like, uh, like uh, raising the prices uh, that 
uh, comes uh, um, uh, not just uh, not comes in a in a rational way. We need, of course, um, to go on and expand the pro the, the the huge uh, mega project. Despite, of course, we have uh, a lower finance right now, but we need to expand it and we, we need to tackle on building our own base uh, base of economy, base of industry, expand the, the agricultural uh, lands and the, the lands that is uh, good for uh, to, uh, for uh, cultivating. We need to have those crops that fight the and, and uh, resist the, the high uh, temperature and the low of water uh, irrigation. We need uh, the the the, uh, the scientific the, the Egyptian sci scientists to take part in this uh, technologies to help uh, um, uh, having our own uh, solidarity and our own initiative to build our own industry, to cultivate our own food. Uh, that's the, the, the most important way to protect our own uh, economy. So, uh, sir, uh, in your opinion, what are the challenges uh, that uh, are expected to face uh, the new cabinet? Well, of course, uh, it, it should, uh, the work should uh, uh, be transported smoothly uh, from uh, the old to the, to the new. And um, for the, the new uh, ministers, they should uh, realize that not everything uh, was bad. It was uh, some of the, some of some great uh, things were accomplished, and also they need to correct the wrongs, correct the mistakes that uh, the, the, um, some of the ministers have uh, fallen in. This is a very important uh, strategy that should be together all in the cabinet by one vision by taking the lines of uh, making the most important he thing here is to, 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 uh, to expand our, uh, the, cap the, cap the capability of our own uh, economy, uh, to depend on ourselves, to depend on our own uh, powers, and to take more powers from the society to take part uh, in, the, in, the, in, the, uh, in the march towards uh, renaissance, for we need to expand in the matter of uh, the medium and the, the, the small uh, and the very small projects so, uh, so, so that the, the ordinary citizens can take part uh, and serve uh, at the same line of uh, uh, deepening up our own pillars of, uh, of, of economy. And of course, uh, to, to keep up the good work in the, in the mega projects and uh, to open more gates for um, investments and investors from both sides of the world, East and the West, with the same measures of our own solidarity and control, not just to be opening the door uh, like uh, any investor to come, but to be under uh, the umbrella of our own best interests, what suits us, uh, we take it, what, what doesn't suit us, we, sh we shouldn't, and also I must tackle something very uh, yes. also, something very important here, which uh, we we are following the the, the agenda or the st the strategy of the UN uh, 2030. Not all of this agenda is uh, suiting our not uh, not going on with our own values uh, as a, as a society. We should only take what uh, what suits us. Only we should only take what comes along with our own um, aspect of uh, values and uh, concepts and our own identity, our own culture, our own civilization that uh, is higher and more supreme than any uh, other Western or Eastern uh, civilization that gives us the right to choose what's, what's uh, good for us and what doesn't what doesn't be good for us, we shouldn't take. This is a very important point. So, sir, uh, also, um, I think one of the tasks of the new government also uh, is uh, to raise uh, the uh, enhanced citizens' national uh, awareness. And uh, uh, one of the concerns of the new government should be this. So, uh, how can this be achieved? Well, I believe 
that uh, we need a ministry of uh, uh, of media. Yes. We should we should have this uh, ministry to enhance and concentrate the media campaigns that is really necessary uh, for the for the nation. So there are there are a gap between the nation and the media in this part only uh, you as a channel and some uh, few channels that is doing the best role in this field we need to to have to have you under umbrella of a minister uh, ministry uh, we need more campaigns we need we need more communication between the leadership and the nation uh, Mr. President, when he speaks to the nation, the, the people listen. But also we need channels, uh, official channels, uh, legitimate uh, official channels to be uh, uh, like uh, your channel, like my spear channels. This is the only, this is the, leg the, the legitimate tongue of the nation. And it should be under uh, a whole lot of umbrella. This is a very important thing to have, to have, so we can connect the more connection between the leadership and, and the nation. So, so some, too many people, sometimes they lose vision. Who is, uh, why was this um, uh, decision was taken? Why didn't they, they yes. take this decision? Answers should, should be given to them. Yes, I'd like to thank you, Mr. Amr Abdrahman, journalist. Thank you for being with us. And if you are, show break and we'll be back. So stay tuned.